Splash, what's going on with your eye? Why are you holding your eye shut? What's the matter with your eye? Stella, Splash, Simba, Hydrox, and Boo. The Lucky Ferals. Today is New Year's Eve, and the cats are having a special breakfast. They're having some Tiki Cat sardine cutlets. They have not had these since last Christmas season. Um, they tried these during Advent of 2017, and they like these a lot, so I'm gonna see if they like them again. The ingredients are sardines, sardine broth, sunflower seed oil, locust bean gum, choline chloride, xanthan gum, paprika, paprika, taurine, and then it goes into vitamin and mineral supplements. So it's basically just sardines, broth, and additional vitamins and minerals to meet the cat's nutritional requirements. So they should like these. Simba's waiting to eat. Stella's ready to eat. Boo's ready to eat. This is what they look like in the can, and you could see the like reddish orange color. That's the paprika that they add to it. I guess they just add that for looks to make it a little bit more appealing to the eye. And this is what the food looks like after I have divided the can into four segments. And then I've kind of squashed each segment down because I think it's easier for them to eat. Um, the pieces of sardine are quite firm and it's mostly this like gelatinous broth um, surrounding the pieces of sardine and it all seems quite dry so I am going to add additional water to this. I just added a few tablespoons of water to each serving and it looks a lot better now. Everything's like a lot looser and there are still chunks in it. So it's not like it's just totally um, like a pate or anything, um, but it's always good for cats to get more liquid. Boo's eating his food. He did not need any bribing whatsoever. He's really, really enjoying it. Simba's eating his food. He did not need any bribing either. And this is the platter for Stella and Splash. And Stella's enjoying her food, but Splash ran halfway up the steps. And then Splash ran all the way up the steps. So it seems that Splash does not like this food. Either that or he'll come back and eat later. But knowing Stella, she'll probably eat Splash's. Boo is eating so fast. Usually he's the slowest eater, but he's really eating fast. I put Splash's food aside for him so none of the other cats could eat it. And they're all upstairs right now. And Splash was downstairs so I shut the door so he's the only one down here. And I gave him a few little crunchies on his food to entice him to eat it. So hopefully he'll eat it. And then I'll open the door between the upstairs and downstairs. But the other cats just really like this food. And they would have totally eaten his portion, no problem. Good morning, Hydrox. How are you today, Hydrox? How are you, Hydrox? Good morning, Hydrox. How are you today? I see a little bit of drool coming off the uh, front of his mouth. How are you, Hydrox? Hydrox is also getting some of the Tiki Cat sardines. I mixed a whole bunch of water in along with some herbs. Yeah, that's his breakfast. He went straight over to it to eat it.
It is 11, 12 a.m. right now, and I've been sitting here replying to comments on YouTube for the past 45 minutes. It, um, sometimes it takes quite a while to read them all and reply, and Boo has been sitting on the scratch and roll, and he's been playing with this wobbly toy well he's really just been trying to eat the feathers off of it and I think he actually pulled a feather or two off of it oh my god I think he's pulled like all the feathers off of it oh my gosh yep there's a whole bunch of feathers on the ground anyway as he was doing that Splash came over to him and Splash wanted to play but you know Boo doesn't really know how to share toys very well so Splash was just sitting there, like, watching him and, like, waiting for his chance to play. And, of course, I didn't have the camera with me, so I went and I got the camera and I just turned the camera on and we saw what just happened when I turned the camera on. All of a sudden, Boo wants my attention. And as I'm filming this, he's rubbing up against my back. And now he's rubbing against my arm. And there goes Splash. He's checking out the toy. Anything with feathers in this house, like, doesn't last very long. Because Boo likes to pluck the feathers. <laughs> Someone should make some kind of cat toy that has, like, a whole bunch of feathers that the cats can pluck out. But then you can, like, put back in. That would be so cool. It's like, okay, the cat's plucked out the feathers. Okay, put the feathers back in. Now they're all, they're all looking what's going on. And from this angle, we could see that Boo plucked out two of the big green feathers. Right now it's about 1.30 p.m. and I just got back. And Hydrox came out of the shelter. And he's been meowing a little bit, but he looks really good right now cleaned himself all up after he ate his breakfast. Right, Hydrox? You look like a whole new cat. And I have a squeeze up here for him. This is a squeeze up. And I'm wondering if he'll come and eat it out of my hand. Probably not. I held something out to him a little while ago and he was afraid of it. So I'm just gonna squeeze this into the bowl for him. I just put the squeeze up in the bowl. And there's Hydrox, and here's the squeeze up. Hydrox, want the squeeze up? Here. Here. Would you like it? Would you like it? Hydrox is eating his squeeze up. That is his New Year's treat. This is the squeeze up with chicken. It has tuna in it, but it's not the one that has more tuna in it. Because he's been eating a lot of tuna lately. It's 4 p.m. right now, and I just looked out the back door, and Hydrox is sitting on this welcome mat that I put by the garage. He's just hanging out. He's waiting for food. He's waiting for the feeder, and he's also waiting for the back door. But it's not time to eat yet. I've been feeding him, like, right before the sun goes down. It is 4.36 p.m., I just opened the back door and Hydrox came running to the door from the doormat on the other side of the patio, most likely because it's raining. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take his food out to him. I just prepared his dinner. He's getting three of the homemade raw scoops uh, along with some water and a squeeze up mixed in and some herbs. Okay, Hydrox. And I'm going to go, I'm going to go grab the stainless steel bowl that's out there. I'm going to put his food in it and then I'm going to put it under the patio table so he can eat where it's dry. I put his food under the table and you might be able to see his tail sticking out. So he walked over there. He's eating. He's very happy to have his food. Right now it's about 46 degrees out. For some reason it feels like it's colder than that, but I'm really happy that it's 46 and not like 36 or... 26 where we'd be having snow the cats are all eating on happy new year plates to celebrate the new year for dinner today the cats are each getting one and a quarter scoops of the homemade raw food with a squeeze up mixed in one squeeze up split four ways and some water so 
They should like the squeeze up taste. And I did not have to bribe them with anything else. Just one squeeze up mixed in the food. The only thing is now I have to stand here until they finish because if I go upstairs, Boo will follow me. It looks like Splash is racing through his food. He's like half done already. I put the small paper plates on the larger platter just because it's easier for me to serve it that way than balancing four paper plates. I don't want to drop anything. But as Splash is eating on his, it's kind of moving on to Stella and Simba's. Is he done? Now he's going to eat some of Stella's. I hope he doesn't overeat and then get sick. I don't want any vomiting. It looks like Simba is nearly done with his food also. Okay. Splash just went back upstairs. Boo's still eating. Boo's only eaten about a quarter of his food so far. He's eating slowly. Yeah, and Splash is completely done and looks like Simba's done too. Yeah, Simba's licking his plate clean. Simba knows the trick of putting his paw on a plate to keep it from moving. Now he's checking out Splash's plate to see if he left anything. Stella's still eating hers. They really enjoyed that. Stella says, why are you pushing that plate on top of my plate? It is 8.23 p.m. right now, and I just looked over at Splash, and he's keeping his right eye shut. Splash, look at me. See? He's keeping his eye closed. Now, the last time I saw him a little while ago, he wasn't. So I don't know what's going on with his eye. I don't know if he scratched it on something. I don't know if he has something in it. But this is a very sudden occurrence. And... He was not in any fights that I heard. Like, there was no fights. I did not hear any cats jumping around or anything. So to me, I think he just has something in his eye that he needs to get out of his eye. Splash, what's the matter with your eye? Like, I don't want to freak him out or anything. Splash, what's going on with your eye? Why are you holding your eye shut? What's the matter with your eye? You okay? You need to get something out of your eye? You got something in your eye? Do you have something in your eye? You want me to get an eye wipe? Get an eye wipe to help you? Just leave you alone? Splash, what's going on with your eye? You don't feel good? You okay? I told Splash to shake his eye. To shake his head. So his eye's tearing a little bit, like there's some tears coming out of it. But if you have something in your eye, like that's what's going to happen. You want the tears to wash out whatever's in the eye. And he shook his head a few times. But, you know, it's not like cats can really rub it with their fingers or not that they want to. That might cr scratch the eye, but like we don't want him pawing at it or anything. And now he's opening it, so I think he just had something in it. He's looking at Boo right now. Good boy, Splashy. Splash went back to sitting there with his eye closed. Or partially closed. What's the matter, Splashy? You okay? Splash, are you okay? You feel okay? Can I pet you? Thank you for watching this Lucky Farrells video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you'd like me to post more videos, and please make sure to check out these other videos that were selected especially for you.